Alright guys, so this is the Carcare AET-1 diagnostic kit. Uh, I'm just going to do a short demonstration as you can see on this BMW here. We have the ABS light, the brake light and the traction warning light displayed on our dashboard here. Now, uh, we're going to show you this kit in action. Basically, first of all, diagnosing the actual fault. We're using a touch screen here. You can use your fingers to scroll through the actual menus if you want to. So we're just waiting for the kit to connect to the BMW module here. So we'll click on manually select. We'll click on uh, 3 Series E46. Click on chassis, ABS anti-lock brake. Just going to click 16 pin socket and it's going to give us the option to diagnose faults or read fault codes from the ABS system in this BMW. Should give us a better idea of where the actual fault is. Can take 30 seconds or so to actually connect to the ECU. So while we're waiting, this kit is available at Diagnostic World. It's www.diagnostic-world.com. Right, so we'll read fault memory. It's got here 5DC0, wheel speed sensor, rear right. Okay, now we already knew that was the problem, in all honesty, because we diagnosed it prior to making this video. Uh, so we've already swapped out the ABS sensor. What we need to do is clear the fault memory, put the new ABS sensor in, we clear the fault memory and we should see if we can get rid of the warning lights. Sometimes uh, the warning lights might not go off straight away. Sometimes you might need to get the wheels in motion. Um, but there we go, they've gone off there. All apart from the brake warning light. But that is of course because we have the handbrake in play here. So, um, that's just a short demonstration of the uh, care car AET-1. It's a dealer level diagnostic package. Um, it will do all sorts. Uh, DPF regenerations, key coding, programming, ECU programming, you name it. Uh, it's a dealer level diagnostic package. It's available at www.diagnostic-world.com or you can click the link directly below this video. Thanks for watching and I hope this helps.